Hey folks, my name is Adrian and I had the opportunity to demo a stand-up paddleboard, a sub. And um, I had the opportunity uh, from Sam Root of Salty Shores, uh, saltyshores.com. If you want to check them out, please do so. Um, this is the Dragonfly 13 foot 6. And um, as you can see here, it's a uh, very nice paddleboard, I should say. Uh, this is my first um, especially, uh, experience on the SUP, especially fishing from one, which I was kind of doubting it. Um, so Sam said, hey, come out and try this one out. So I did. This is Tom's uh, from Wang Anchor, his uh, custom paddleboard. And as you can see there, it's a V-hull uh, in the keel. Um, they're from what I know, you can have a flat version as well, but uh, I'm sure there's a pretty, you know, I'm sure there's a hull slap with the uh, the flat version, but uh, there was very little on this one at all, if at all. Um, you're going to see me here mounting the paddleboard here. You know, I had plenty of practice earlier in the morning. Uh, we were out from 3 to 8, uh, you know, drift fishing and whatnot, and uh, getting my quote-unquote feet wet uh, on the paddleboard. Um Tracking is pretty good, you know, uh, you really can't compare it to a kayak, you know, at least I feel you shouldn't. Um, this is my first experience on a paddleboard, and, you know, it went where I wanted it to go. You know, obviously you're going left to right. Um, once you get your bearings, you know, balance is not an issue. If you are you have good balance, once you get your center of gravity on the paddleboard, you won't even think about, you know, falling off this. Um, so, yeah, I had a, a, a great time paddling. We did about six miles. Uh, of uh, paddling and drifting and um, yeah it's a great core workout if you're looking for a good fitness on the water this is it I mean kayaking I've kayaked for quite a few years and it's it's great it's a good exercise but paddleboard hands down uh, a great exercise core exercise you know abdomen lower back uh, especially your arms triceps um, so yeah I enjoyed that aspect of it um, so as you can see, I'm switching from my paddle to my uh, fishing rod, and uh, we pretty much used top water all day, which was amazing action actually with uh, some red fishing trout and lost some nice snook. And um, yeah, I wasn't even thinking about my balance at this point. You know, casting what I, I did it effortlessly, especially Sam. Um, you glide on these boards on the water, man. Let me tell you, just uh, one, two good push, and you're 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 going. Um, so. Uh, that that's a great thing about uh, about a paddleboard. Um, you, the paddle is effortless, um, especially uh, you know you can adjust the paddle too to your liking. Um, I want to show you the special fitting that was added onto Tom's uh, Wang Anchor style paddleboard. I should say, uh, uh, if you don't know what a Wang Anchor is, it's basically a stakeout pole. It's an anchor system that we use a lot here in Florida, and um, basically during kayak fishing and whatnot you know I've seen some boats with the wang anchor system and it just keeps you in place uh, whether you want to get off your, your boat your kayak or whatnot and um, I found myself to be um, having to counterbalance myself when I was on the stand up paddle board while I staked out uh, as you can see here there was there, there was a little bit of play um, actually a little bit enough to to make you feel like you want to fall off so once I removed the wang anchor from the uh, the paddle board I was fine um, it's perfect for getting off and waiting though uh, um, you know I have to admit so um, it, it's it's a great concept there uh, to have that on the paddle board something that I would probably do um, you can see Sam here making it look effortlessly uh, from switching to his uh, fishing rod from the paddle and you can see him gliding right past me um, I'm telling you, it's amazing how quick these things, uh, how well these things do glide on the water. Um, and fishing, is it's, it's great to fish from it. As you can see, Sam has a K2 cooler. Um, and uh, I believe this is the 30 cubic of the uh, the K2 cooler. I could be mistaken, but um, I, I looked inside of it. It's nice. It's great for storage and especially for sitting down, especially if you're paddling a uh, good distance like Sam and I did. Um, you know, I, I just sat down on the paddleboard and, and I kneeled sometimes as well, which is a good thing too. The flat surface is perfect. Um, uh, you know, you can add ride holders and whatnot to the paddle boards. Um, if I if I did get one, I probably would add a trolley system too for the for the stake off pole. But that's something that you know that to think about. Um, the non skid surface is awesome too from Sea Deck. 
So, uh, you know, uh, Sam's next adventure is to catch a tarpon, so look out for that on Salty Shores. And uh, thanks.